Hi guys and girls, this is Atif and you're watching my channel Moon333 where I'm posting the different ideas on cryptocurrency stock, forex and on different assets and also educational stuff. If you didn't subscribe to my channel so far then do subscribe it for more profit potential trading ideas and educational videos and do remember that the information contained in this video is for educational purpose only, this is not intended to be investment advice, so please seek a duly licensed professional for investment advice. As in my 16 August post of total 2 index chart, I predicted that the altcoins are gonna take a big move soon and now you can see all altcoins are on the run. Some coins are increased by 50%, some coins are 30% and some are getting ready to move soon. But overall the altcoin market has started a big bull move, now let's move to my that chart and this is a chart total 2 and this is the all altcoin index except Bitcoin and this index represents all altcoins move. On this chart we can see the altcoin index has formed a shark pattern and if we see the dimensions of the pattern this is initial X to A leg, the A to B leg is retraced between 0.382 to 6.8 Fibonacci as required for the, B, for the A to B of shark leg and the B to C leg is retraced between 1.13 to 1.618 as required for the B to C leg of shark. And the final leg, the C to D leg is retraced between 0.886 up to 1.13 Fibonacci. And when I published the chart, you can see the price action was just giving a spike within this potential reversal zone and the price action had completed the shark pattern. And if we see the different indicators, for example, I place the volume profile and I have selected the complete price action of this pattern within the fixed range of the volume profile, then we can see this profile, the volume profile is giving us the signals that the traders are not interested or less interested to trade at potential reversal zone. And we can also see the Ichimoku cloud was turned bullish and it was turned green from red and the price action was also hitting the support of the Bollinger Bands and it was likely to have the bounce from here but MACD was strong bearish you can see the histogram of the MACD was strong or dark red now if we move to the live chart and this is a live chart I'm just taking you to the live chart to show you the live situation of total 2 index and this is the 4 day live chart I'm just taking you to the chart I just need to remove all the indicators to make it more visible for you and this is the 4 day and here we have the price action formation of shark pattern. Okay, on this chart we can have two patterns. First we can also form a cipher pattern if we take the initial X to A leg from here from the very bottom of the price action and this is the initial leg and after initial X to A leg the A to B leg is retraced up to 0 0.30 Fibonacci or 0.31 or 32 or 30 Fibonacci but for the cipher pattern the A to B leg should be retraced between 0.382 to 0.618 Fibonacci and the C to D leg is retraced almost up to 1.27 Fibonacci and the final leg is retraced almost up to 0.618 to 7.86 Fibonacci as required for the cipher pattern. But this retracement is not fulfilling the B to C condition, the retracement condition for the cipher pattern. Therefore, I am going for the shark pattern. And this is the bullish shark pattern. And I have taken the leg from here, the initial X to A leg and after A to B leg is retraced between 0.382 to 618 Fibonacci as required for the shark pattern 
and C to D lag is retraced between 1.13 to almost 1.618 and now the price action is entered in the potential reversal zone with the retracement between 0.886 up to 1.13 Fibonacci almost up to here so this is our potential reversal zone where the price action had entered almost this is our potential reversal zone and now you can see the price action is gearing up and now if I place the MACD this is the MACD indicator which was strong bearish at that time when I published this chart here you can see it was strong bearish but now it is turned weak bearish and the moving averages of this MACD indicator are likely to give bull cross soon. This blue line is gonna cross up this red line soon. And if we see the stochastic now, this is a stochastic oscillator, and we can see the stochastic has also given us the bull cross. This blue line has crossed up this red line. So this is a strong bullish signal. Now we have all the indicators turning bullish or some indicators are turned strong bullish or weak bullish and on this chart we can see now the price action is moving towards the sell targets I have defined as per Fibonacci levels and this is the chart I'm just moving back again to my published chart. And here I have defined my sell target zone from 0.382 to 7.86 Fibonacci from the CD Fibonacci projection. And if I will play the idea, then you can see the price action is geared up and moving towards these sell targets. In the meanwhile, all the altcoins will take a big bullish move, but the real bullish move will be started when this price action will cross up this sell target zone and move above this 786.786 sell target zone. Then there will be some possibility that all altcoins or most of the altcoins will make higher highs or highs than the previous highs. Now let's move to the Bitcoin chart I've published and let's see what the Bitcoin can do in the meanwhile. And this is a chart. BTC, USD. A cryptocurrency chart and this can be the chart I just need to find this chart the Bitcoin USD I've published a few days back and this is the chart now on this chart you can see the price action is consolidating within this pennant and in fact this pennant is the first bull flag and the consolidation level is from 12,000 almost up to $9,300 and the price action is consolidating within this level and if we see the Ichimoku cloud then you can see the Ichimoku cloud is turned bullish or turned green after a year it was turned bearish in November 2018 and now it is turned bullish in November 2019 and when the last Ichimoku cloud turned bullish then it was remained bullish for almost 2.5 years and if we see the lagging span of this Ichimoku cloud then it is also turning bullish and moving up and we have the 100 moving average and the 50 moving average as strong support below the price action and the both moving averages are in death cross and likely to make a golden cross soon. This small moving average is gonna cross up this big moving average soon. So if the price action will break down this pan and support, then our first support can be at $7,500 where we have the 100 moving average. But breaking down the support of this pan and is very difficult cause all the indicators are getting bullish. If we see the chop zone, the chop zone is strong bullish for almost last five months. And when the chop zone last turned bullish in 2015, it was remained bullish for almost 2.2 years. 
So more indications are in favor of bull move rather than bearish move. So we can expect that our next stop is this resistance level at 16,300 or the price action can give a spike up to $17,200. So this time when the altcoins will be moving up, Bitcoin can even move to sideways or the Bitcoin can move up or bullish move. But this time the Bitcoin will move up with all other altcoins. So be ready for the next bullish divergence, a big bullish divergence by the Bitcoin and a big bull rally from the altcoins price action as well. This was my today's analysis and you can see how this analysis is getting proven and how the altcoins have started a big bull move. And soon you'll see how the Bitcoin will be moving up very, very bull move. Thank you so much for watching the complete video guys. I'll be back soon with more profit potential, trading ideas and educational stuff. If you didn't subscribe to my channel then do subscribe it and if you like the video then do hit the like. Take care. Goodbye.